Hi, welcome back. Uh, I'm Karthik. Welcome back to my market channel. In this video, I'm going to uh, show you how, how to use the make for uh, make for, uh, map function effectively. Uh, make uh, as a advanced or no code automation platform and uh, we use it uh, for a uh, different pur uh, purposes and it's uh, it mimics uh, unlike Zapier it mimics more or less uh, programming lang uh, language kind of uh, versatility and like uh, uh, advanced functions uh, even so that we can extract any any type of data whether it's a collection or array i will show you how uh, how to effectively uh, get a data out of a collection and by comparing it with a separate value uh, uni uh, unique value and you uh, and then uh, i will explain you about uh, how to use it uh, for the sake of this demo i'm uh, i have pasted i have used a json which which is received from a web book uh, from a c uh, from a third party platform and uh, the and and i'm using the past json module uh the uh, well, this passes the json and uh, and our uh, and uh, uh, outputs to the next immediate model uh here i have used a set multiple variables like you can you you can set variable uh, you can use set uh, single variable or multiple variable and you can use those variables in uh, further modules like uh, say docusign module or like a slack module or like any other module you like or like a google sheet module wherever you wish to use this variable you can use this uh just uh, this is like a data uh, this is for the say um, for the simplicity I'm, i have taken a part of a data um part of this whole json data this is you can see this is a long data here and you have it has all the different uh, values um and the, and the code structure is like this this has an id name city field key field key is like uh, which is populated from the web book uh, what if if at all this has the same kind of thing but the um, as a, another id uh just wait this one is a user one city user one city is That could be a case you want to fetch the user city uh, user city not the user one city and uh, and the value you have to get uh, for the particular output is like you want to get the miami not and not the charlotte you also want to ensure that it's not the charlotte this particular uh, field only you like to grab and this one you don't you just want to exclude it uh, if at all you use you can you, uh, in in case of array you can use an index like uh, um, get function and uh, um, uh, and uh, play and uh, and use the appropriate index like one two three or four but here it's a collection so i will show you how to use the uh, map function here this is the map function say uh, you, uh, i have because we are using uh, setting it as a variable we can use like city or you can use it any name you wish and data uh, data dot custom value is a collection is a collection and this has all the values here id name field key city these are all the values available and uh, if if you place a condition like this name it will uh, map function uh, remember map function returns an array okay and uh, if we uh, if i am running it i will throw a result like city it, it will throw all the ids all the ids within that json structure 
so uh, but, but you want to have want to have a specific uh, some specific output of 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 which has the name equal to user city so what i am doing i am adding a condition here first one is like uh, when you use map function you have to uh, give a collection and then you have to place which one you want to extract here in our case it's like id and then we can use yeah which which field we can uh, which field we can use it as compare to uh, compare name and City. Now, if you run it, it will it will bring up the one I a single ID only. Just because the map returns an array, uh, map, uh, an array, those array, then you can extract it uh, from this array the desired value by using the index also. Um, now i want the city not the id right so what i have what we have to do i have to go and remove the id field and then place the city field here now the map function we are saying the map function to yeah, use this collection and extract the field name called the city but the the same uh, json has to have the name equals user city if the name equals user city you extract this field if the name equals user one city then you just ignore the structure itself this is what we are uh, conveying to the map function and it will then now let's save it and run this now you can see city uh, is returning as miami this is what the exact thing we need uh, this is how the map function works and you can add any other module and use that uh, where the set variable uh, and use that get variable and use this variable as and wherever you like to use this one Having fetched the uh, 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 exact value we're using the map function, but uh, we need uh, we need to set the variable with a single uh, output, right? Like a string output or a, like a number. It's it should not be an array, but the map function returns an array. So we have to extract the value from the map function. As uh, so that we get it this uh, standalone string output which we like to have how to use that one you have to use the function called get close it enclose the map function this one has only one uh, uh, one element in that are uh, returning array of the map function so i am using the uh, number one get imagine this whole thing as array and it has one element and that element I will... that's a string This is how we can uh, effectively use the map function as well as the get function uh, in coherence to get the required output. Thanks for watching.